Good morning everyone and happy Sunday, August 6th. I'm on my way to go get a massage after one of the longest, hardest weeks. Not hardest as in like, it's the hardest week of my life. That's like way too dramatic to just jump right there. However, I will say this week did have like a lot of series of unfortunate events that just like were very defeating moments. And I just kept going, just kept like picking up my big girl pants. The universe kept trying to test me. Started with my rental car bumper falling off. Dealing with the stress of like a damaged rental car is not fun. Smallest, most minor things just kept like going wrong. And those are the things that defeat me, you guys. Like it's never the big stuff. The big stuff stresses me out. And then afterwards, every little thing is just like defeating. Like I expect a win on like the small day-to-day -day trial. I just assume that those are winnable because they're easy. I forget that even life laughs at your face sometimes and is like, yeah, no. Oh, and what also sent me this week is I lost my wallet for a moment and all of my credit cards, my insurance, my <laughs> driver's license, everything was gone. And that like literally I was driving to and from two different Sprouts and I found it. That stress was so much and I did not go to school that night. So then that was just like, you know, domino effect reaction. I don't know, just like I let myself down, but like at the same time, I also am trying to learn, respect my mental and when I need to set boundaries that are healthy for me and my mental space. I think there was like a few little bullshit things that happened. I was just like over it and I was like whatever. Saturday, everything's great. Everything was beautiful. The vibes were immaculate. Oh, I remember what happened Friday. The fire alarm. <laughs> the fire alarm at work went off and someone was in service and we were just like... I'm so sorry you're falling asleep during your massage. We hope you enjoy the complimentary fire drill. If you want, we can validate your parking for free like we do everyone else as a apology. <laughs> oh, but seriously, like that was like super funny. We never used to like, evacuate the whole place, but the building's making us, which you know, in retrospect is probably a good thing that we do. But yeah, there was like people coming out like in mid steam, like so they were just like with their towels on, like it was so funny saturday was a great day it was a beautiful saturday it's like the last like 45 minutes of my shift and i'm just like you know what i'm hungry i've saved my salmon all day to eat this is like the really good salmon from sprouts salmon ain't cheap i go down to the fridge and the maintenance team cleaned out the whole fridge i go to the back to at least see if my like container was there you know that i brought the food in they tossed that too this bullshit keeps happening Bullshit. After this like weird storm of a super moon charged week, I'm going to get a massage right now. I'm about to get a massage from Charles. He is my guy. I love him. If you want to book a massage with him or anyone, if you just want a massage, babe. 15% off massage. Literally slide into my DMs on IG girl. Or boy. I don't I don't know what my audience is like. I didn't tell you this, but we're gonna go to the beach. We're gonna go to Malibu with Nico and Milo and Kitty. I'm gonna go get my massage. I'll chat with you in a sec. I'm on my way back home. I'm gonna change into my beach things. Pretty much, yeah, we're just gonna go to the beach from there. Self-explanatory. I am eating my favorite thing ever. It's what I normally snack on in the morning. Like, I break my fast with one of these peanut butter bars by Perfect 365. I always love to wash one of those down with a peach mango green tea Celsius. This is my favorite Celsius. I've been having it for, like, since 2016. So good. Oh, hi. Nico is just a witness to my bad luck. I literally was just trying to take out my vlog camera to vlog how cute he was with his matching pouch and swim trunks. And her thing just shattered, exploded. Her, whatever it's called, was it my water? Flask? No, it's just my water bottle. It's like one of the beakers, BKR from Amazon. The amount of times I've dropped that thing and it's never once shattered because it's got a rubber protector. It's got a condom on it. I'm just shocked that, actually I'm not shocked with the way things have been going lately. <laughs> Like, I literally, what I just, like, I was like, you know what, whatever. I cleaned it up, I threw it away, I yeah. moved on. Look at us with our matching necklaces, though. 
Kyo Beach Neckies. Nico and I are on our way to go pick up Milo. As I mentioned earlier, we are all going to the beach. Milo just texted me. He's like, this Barbie party till five last night and is slow but alive. <laughs> What's all here? How's it going vlog? I had a really good night. I stayed out till 5 a.m. last night. Oh Party, drank, danced my face off. What elbow. What's up with the vlog? What are you guys doing today? Anyway, we're headed to the beach. Where are we going, Malibu? Yeah. We're going to the boo. We're gonna tan, we're play some football. We're not at the beach, but we made it to rail. So, Babe, no, you need some like so Pedialyte. What is it? A burrito. Oh. Yeah. It's got a full on shot of Kitty's tits. There was no burrito. More burrito than this titties and <laughs> Oh my god, Nico. I thought you were just some random guy. I was like, who the fuck is walking over Why, to Kitty? I have a shirt on? A yeah. <laughs> Grab one of the big pop uh, You and your pickles at the beach. They're good. What sounds great to you, babe? Avocado toast. Ooh. They got that? Excuse me, do you guys have avocado toast? Avocado toast. <laughs> You got your stairs? Uh huh. Wait, well, is it never forget? There you go. Okay. Oh, I'm like red road. <laughs> Nika's about to tingle lotion my back. Oh! I was like, wait. Did you just see that? <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're, Haley, you're gonna have to blow that out. I just got a football shot. <laughs> Clickbait title Nico's naked at the beach. <laughs> oh, I just had my titties out too. Oh my god, everyone's undressed. It's a strip beach. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not ticklish, so. No, you're fine. Y'all are just vibing right here. Their food. What is happening? The fuck is happening? Oh my god. What the hell? What the actual? Like attacked by dogs with a terrifier landing on us. Riley to your left. What the? There's too much happening right now. The boys are playing football and Kitty and I are just laying here. She's munching. Very relaxing. I feel great right now. Gonna go in the city. Yeah, we're gonna go in the water. I'm down to go. Are you? Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> this dive. I just jumped in the water. Hello is somehow purely dry after that. I don't know how he does it. <laughs> How does he do it? We got back from the beach. Everybody just kind of went in their own directions. I think everybody's kind of pooped right now, but both Riley and I just showered off the ocean. Pretty salty and also like we got kind of got stuck in like a seaweed patch towards the end. Panicked and just got out really quick, so both of us had like seaweed in our hair and on our body. So we had to shower. Now we're both just hanging out and we're about to play this game called Castle Crashers. It's a fun like comic themed Game, how would you explain it? Like comic key? It's all, it, like, I don't know, it's very like old school Nintendo yeah. style. Yeah. It's fun, you have to like hit. save damsels in distress and then we have to fight for them. So that was Nika's attempt at an update. Yeah, uh, sharing the brain cell right now, it's her turn. Pretty much, and just kind of have a chill Sunday evening. That shower was so good, was yours good? It was revolutionary. No, literally that was like top eight yeah. showers in my life. Just at least make it through the log portion because the doors are hard. Yeah. Oh shit. Okay, you got through. You got a free pass on one of the logs. Hits. Oh god. <laughs> I got confused. You both did the same thing. <gasps> no! 
Hello and good morning you guys. Happy Monday, August 7th. I am very behind schedule today. My plan was to like wake up at 7, go to the gym, start heading to Carson, to the Lash Boutique by opening at 9. Yeah, no babe, it's like 10 o'clock. I'm like just now heading to the gym. My body just really needed rest this morning after a full day in the sun yesterday. It's the week that I had. I got a massage yesterday so that probably also made it very easy to fall asleep for me because my body was just like chilling. I'm just not okay right now. This Monday is really giving Monday. I'm gonna be TMI for a second. Like I think I just started my period. So I'm just kind of like, you know what I mean? Like <laughs> I'm here, but I'm not here. Basically, I went into the gym today expecting to do cardio and abs. I walked on the treadmill with the incline up and then I vogued for a little bit. I don't know how to get on a treadmill and not runway for a sec. Like it's just, it's what I do. It's how I live my dream of being a supermodel. Not having to actually live it out because if I did, that would just be too much, you know? Like to only give so much in my life. So I give to the YouTube aspect. If I gave to the modeling, it would just be too much. You guys would see me everywhere. If I started acting, you know, I don't want to infiltrate your films too. Let me just keep it to one form of entertainment because I don't I don't want you to get sick of me you know it's a luxury to be on this YouTube channel okay I'm on one we're back at it again today with the Celsius peach mango green tea and the perfect peanut butter bar I exchanged Instagrams with my crush and I did it so smoothly too like oh my god like I had a plan and I didn't think it was gonna work but it did should I write a book would you guys if I did like an e-file a PDF digital download, if you will, an ebook. How to get your crush's Instagram at the gym. Would you read that? This guy's watching me vlog. I wouldn't charge you. I'm just asking if you would download it. Like, if I created a guide on how to get your mans. I know how to. I've just avoided doing so. I've never had a boyfriend. I've avoided getting one because of my own reasonings and self-inflicted problems. But, you know, I'm really good at setting other people up. just got to the business park where the Aki Lashes boutique is. So I'm about to go shopping, drop some coin on them lash supply. Headquarters of Aki Lashes. This is where I did my training, got my cert, all that good stuff. I just secured the bag. It is hot as butt in my truck right now. Let's do a little lash supply haul. Spent way too much money, but it's okay. I put that shit on credit, so I'll pay it off later. I got some classic pre-made fans, volume pre-made fans, volume lashes on sale. Everything adds up really fast, let me tell you that. And then I got these volumes. These are size 12 through 15. I got a post-care kit for my client to take care of her lashes. Clear volume adhesive. That's supposed to help in theory with people who have like sensitive eyes. And then I also got a lash bonder cause they were doing a deal on these as well. And then I was walking out to the parking lot and I was like vlogging and being all cute and vibing. Then this old man that was creepy tried to talk to me and I just ignored him like an asshole and got in my car. And then he pulled up next to me and then my social anxiety made me just like skirt out. And then I pulled over to do this little haul that we just did to pee so badly. It's supposed to take 40 minutes. So I'm supposed to get home 1242. That gives me like 15 minutes to set up before my client gets there. And then we ballin'. We're being so productive. I'm so proud of us. We couldn't have done this without you, truly. I just finished setting everything up. Here's my little at home. Created a bed, here's my light for all my supplies. Oh God. Kitty, get the vibes. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Is it possible to uh, connect my phone? No. Whip, 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 then I'm serving. Skating round in the phone card straight. I love this song. Are you ready? It's not a hotel smoking cigarette mixing codeine up with a Finnegan She got thick but she wanna get Finnegan Drinking apple cider vinegar wearing skin cause she wanna be Kim in it uh, Alright, I know they are best Every time I call 
we're at Barless. Our first time hanging ever took place here. I did not realize it is 8.45 p.m. I've been drinking since five, that's why. No, because I got off work at six. <laughs> oh. We're ready to party. <laughs> We're literally eating and we're sat in the middle just waiting for it to turn into a club. Woo! How are your fries? You're lying to yourself. I'm fine. I am not fine. I had one sip of this fucking skinny ass margarita. Boy, is it skinny. It is 75% tequila and maybe 5% freaking whatever the fuck she put in there. He tell me. What is wrong with you? No, he's stirring a house. Are we going to Malibu? Babe, there. No. M mute that guy's name, but there. Look. We're not going to that. You see that? You can literally see my eyes look back and forth. It's 925. Oh my god, it's only 925. We are on our way right now to no vacancy. We left our list. It was dead. Are we cool? How far? Rolling up in the pink, yeah. Drop it low. Yeah. It was a drop. It was yeah. Yeah. So good to see you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My mom Angie is waiting for us. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> 